Michael Pizzi is back on the job. Today is his first official day back in office after Wayne Slayton gave up his legal challenge against Pizzi. CBS 4's Gary Nelson has more now from Miami Lakes. For the first time in nearly two years, Michael Pizzi pulled into the mayor's parking spot. It feels great. It's, uh, I'm, I'm ecstatic. I'm absolutely ecstatic. Ecstatic to see his photo again hanging on the Miami Lakes town hall wall, his name and title on the dais of the council. The worst day of my life, the worst and saddest day of my life was when I left here in handcuffs. There Pizzi was in handcuffs accused in a federal corruption case in August 2013. A 12-member jury, though, didn't believe Pizzi was a crook on the take, and neither did his supporters, dozens of whom embraced him, welcomed him back to office Wednesday, awash in hugs and kisses. We knew, knew from the beginning that he was an honest person and he was going to come out clean from all this. So we believed in him. I am back exonerated. I'm back with my sleeves rolled up, and I'm back to resume my duties right this second as mayor of the great town of Miami Lakes. Pissy fought and won an eight-month-long legal battle against the town, and Wayne Slayton elected mayor after Pizzi's arrest. Those who opposed Pizzi's return are ready to bury the hatchet work together. It's, it's a professional relationship. You know, he's uh, he's the mayor of the town right now. I'm the vice mayor, uh, so it's 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 a professional relationship. Pizzi too talked reconciliation. As of right this second, this chapter is closed, and we move on. To a chapter of unity. With that, Pizzi returned to his office. Office of the mayor. The office of the mayor. He plopped into the mayor's chair and thanked his supporters. I would not be here today without you. And Pizzi thanked the Lord. It was my faith in God and this Bible. And I want to tell you something. But for a moment, Michael Pizzi, never at a loss for words, brushed back a tear at a loss for words. Pizzi says he intends to pick up just where he left off a couple of years ago, improving the infrastructure of Miami Lakes, beautifying the city, building parks, and boosting police protection. We're live in Miami Lakes. Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News.